Hi, welcome to Simple Scuba. These are the Subgear Travel Max fins. A fin designed for snorkeling, uh, feature uh, a, a sort of open heel design. They're not adjustable at the back, but they have a very soft, stretchy uh, strap that goes over the hill. So they're, they're open heel, they're not adjustable. Just um, makes it a bit easier to get the foot in and out of the pocket. A uh, bit of a unique shape and profile to the blade. It is a standard style blade in that it doesn't flex um, and sort of form like a shape as it as it goes through the water. It's kind of a pre-shaped form, so it's always at that optimal angle and uh, sort of shape to catch and, and focus water as it goes down the blade. So you have these reinforcing bars down the side which give the blade nice strong strength. It also controls how much the blade will flex as well, so it never sort of just folds in half as you kick too hard. It will just um, bend it to the optimal angle uh, all the time, so it gives you a good uh, propulsion with minimal effort really. So they've got big reinforcing bars down the side and then we have a, a couple of different materials over the blade itself. So they've got these rubber sections that run through, uh, they give it some sort of elasticity so it springs back nice and quickly and you have these more rigid materials which gives it a bit of extra strength and uh, stability to the blade. And then you have this like cupped section in the middle and that's what helps catch the water and sort of channels it down and focus it into a more like a jet off the end so it gives you more controlled propulsion. Foot pocket itself is really really soft it's a nice soft rubber uh, so it's really comfortable to use you can use it bare feet if you want to uh, or you can use it with uh, like a thin neoprene boot or fin sock. Again the fin strap is nice and soft uh, so you are wearing it bare feet is really not going to cause any sort of irritation uh, or soreness against the back of the hill. A nice grip tab on top of the heel straps that makes it easier to pull it over the fin. And they're also um, swivelling, so you can move them down, but they can be released. So rather than have to pull it off over the hill, you can just take the, the clip, push it back in and release it again when you want to take them off. So it does make it a bit easier. It's a little bit more comfortable as well. On the underside, uh, you can see rubber sections through the foot pocket itself. They're really there to give you a bit of, a bit of traction. So uh, on wet surfaces, these rubber sections will give you a bit more um, a bit friction against those uh, wet rocks or uh, pool side or anything like that. Underside of the blade, obviously you can see the foot pocket come down and you've got these two reinforcing bars and they give uh, a bit of extra stability and strength to the point where the, the foot pocket meets the blade. And that point is obviously uh, a whole lot of stress goes through the blade and that prevents over stretching and over flexing of the blade itself. So it never loses strength through that point. And really, because you don't want the blade just flapping around in the water, uh, you need controlled flexibility and that's really what that provides. And you have that also, that larger, stiffer um, rubber section through the middle again to give it stability as it goes through the water. A full length type of blade, uh, so you've got lots of power for it, lots of controlled uh, propulsion. Uh, obviously a little bit longer to fit into bags, but the extra length gives you that extra propulsion. So a good trade-off uh, for weight and um, pack size really. So they are the Subgear Travel Max fins, a great snorkeling fin. 